What's up everyone, this is Cybernod, and today, of course, I finally got my 2020 Megaton case for you guys, so I got that finally from FedEx, they actually, I guess, decided to bring it to me today. It's supposed to be a Friday, but, uh, yeah, again, FedEx hates me. But anyway, it is the, uh, 10 of Lost Memories, we have 12 of them here, so, let's get to it, plain and simple. <laughs> of course, there's quite a few cards I'm trying to hunt down from this set, too, and, uh, if you guys are wondering, I got my case from Big and Collectibles, so check them out. Link in the description. Kind of hard to have everything on camera. There we go. <laughs> and also, uh, if you want to help support my channel, uh, check out my link with TCG Player. It's affiliate link. And if you buy anything from there, after you click on my link, it helps support me. And helps out quite a bit, especially with the case opening. So, I'd really appreciate it. Anyway, got Dark Fluid. Uh, one of the Mermels. Oh, I forgot that was in this. Oh, yeah, there we go. That's a good start. That's one of the main ones I wanted. Uh, we have Dragoonie Knot Romulus. Got a rarity boost. Then, of course, a Strength and Unity. This is one of the newer cards. I haven't gotten it yet. That's awesome. Then, a Star Leads, uh, Seyfert. I don't... No, I haven't gotten this one yet. And then, yeah, we got Blocker as well. Go through these... Eh, fairly quickly. Because I'm hoping this won't be a terribly long video, but... Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Let's skip through our commons, because commons aren't really... Anything crazy on this. Eva Repos. Uh, Marine says Seahorse, Mystic Mine, oh, <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Then, of course, uh, Medusa, and Marine says Marbled Rock, okay. Yeah, they give Mystic Mine a little boost in rarity. Everyone's happy with that, right? Eee. Everyone's favorite card to go up against. Blah. But it does look good. <laughs> I'll give it that. I have uh, Whitefish Salvage. Uh, Zerazel. Oh, that's awesome. There's an Evil Eye Link. Neos Fusion. I'm pretty happy about that rarity boost, too. That's awesome. Then, of course, Witchcrafter Pottery. And then Get Out. Yeah, I believe it's... What is it, like 15 hollows per... per 10? I don't know. It's technically not a Mega 10, but it also kind of is. So that's why I just call them Mega 10s. You know, it's 10 of Lost Souls, but... You know. <laughs> Come on. We know what it is. Try not to knock anything over. Okay, Gladiator Beast. Have Marines a Seahorse, Witchcrafter Creation. IP Mascarina. There we go. Now that's uh, definitely a reprint I wanted to get from this, for sure. Marines says Marbled Rock, and then Medusa again. Yeah, Mascarina, uh, a pretty good reprint. We'll say that, right? <laughs> One of the best reprints out of this. Yeah, every time I'd get one from its original set, I would just sell it because it was always expensive. Have Rogue of Endymion, a Gladiator Rejection, Unchained Abomination, really good reprint on that too. Fusion Destiny and Abomination's Prison. It's a really good Link Monster to get turned to a Prismatic. It looks really nice. Alright, sounding great. Hey. Uh, another one of Salvage. Zerazel. Then World Legacy Monstrosity. I think that one's pretty cool looking too. Then, of course, Witchcrafter Pottery and Get Out. A lot of doubles actually from that one. Dang. I don't know. We might do some kind of recap thing or I just. Might want you guys to watch the full video. I'm not really sure if I'm going to do like a recap at the end or what. We'll see. Especially to say at the beginning of the video, because that's just basically saying, hey, skip to the end. Uh, I mean, you can. I'd prefer you didn't. <laughs> Let's see. Marines is Blue Slug, Time Thief. A Pot of Extravagance. There we go. That's a good one. Win, uh, Wind Charmer. And Dragoon. Already. Dang. What was that? Third 10? Yeah, that was the third one. Well, there we go. I've already gotten one of these. I got it, not yesterday, but the day before. I had just some random 10s I got from Walmart. Because, again, I was waiting on my case. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. I'm definitely going to put those to the side. And uh, we'll see how many we get, basically, from a case. I'm glad I at least got one. <laughs> so far. I heard some people, there were a few different people that didn't even get one from their case, and uh, 
That just sucks. It shouldn't be that tough to get. Uh, Zerizel, Salvage. Guard Dragon Pisty, very nice too. Uh, which is Strike and Dirge of Lost Dragon. I'll be honest, two of the ones I mainly need from this are Borload and uh, Apollosa. I think they're both Prismatics. So hopefully I get them. Uh, Dance with Beast, I didn't notice that was a hollow. Blue Slug. Another extravagance. Dang, I already got the playset now because we got one from the, the same tin we got Dragoon the other day. Uh, Strength and Unity. I love the artwork of this card. And then, uh, yeah, Marine says Coral. Very nice. That's a pretty good tin. Get that Pot of Extravagance and Dragoon. Uh, yeah, that's a win. Because I did not have good luck getting Extravagance from Toon Chaos. So... I'm glad I actually got a place set now of the Prismatic, even. Easier to get reprint, and it's prettier, in my opinion. Let's see. Witchcrafter Creation. Sanet Mining. That's pretty good. I didn't know it was a super in this. Then another Neos Fusion. Successor Soul, and then Unchained Soul of Rage. Dang, we almost got, like, all spell cards. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Yeah, I like some of these rarity boosts we are seeing from this. And uh, Overburst Dragon, Pendulum Holtz, Trickstar Corbane. That's a good one because I remember that being a pain to get. Uh, Psychic uh, Wee Leader, and then Fenetrack Harvester. I don't think you guys care too much on the commons and rares. I'm still kind of bummed out, though, that there's not a promo pack with this Mega Ten. I feel like it needed one. I have Unchained Soul of Anguish, Shinobi Necro, Borload Savage Dragon. There, I saw Synchro. I was hoping it was him and not the Cybers again. There we are. Finally, this card got reprinted. I knew it would be in these tens, but dang, I was hoping they wouldn't do something silly. So, there we go. That definitely needed a reprint. Storm Dragon's Return and Evil Eye's Defeat. There. I mean, I always assumed it would be in this. But, again, I was kind of afraid Konami would uh, try to pull a fast one. Be like, wait a minute. I need this reprint. Because I sold mine when it was... I think it got, like, close to $100 when I sold mine. Alright, now I just need Apollosa, really. It's, like, the main thing I'm after. Rogue of Endymion, Glider Rejection, Guard Dragon Pisty, I'll take that too. The Super Anti Kaiju, and then Witchcrafter by Streets. Yeah, I've never had good luck getting Opelosa, so I'm glad it's in this. Because for its main set, I never got it. Rising Rampage, I think. Uh, Salvage, Zerizel. And then Destiny Hero Dominance. Now that's pretty dang cool looking too. I like that rarity boost. Then Infinitrack Mountain Smasher and Witch's Strike. Not bad at all. There we are. I still wish that would have been a Prismatic. Seriously. I don't know why Crusader didn't get a, a rarity boost. Uh, Retribution, Salvage again. Dang, we have a lot of those. Borload, yeah. <laughs> I was hoping again uh, we'd get one. Uh, Gladiator Beast, uh, oh yeah. That was the one I saw. People kept thinking they got Dragoon, and yeah, there's other fusions. <laughs> and Serizel. I think there was a meme I saw yesterday or something on Facebook where it was someone all excited because they see that fusion. It's like, no. <laughs> the Gladiator Beast is cool, but it's no Dragoon. That happens to me plenty in my openings. You hear that alarm going off in your head, and you're like, ah, I'm about to get some really... Oh, nope. <laughs> so close. Okay, uh, Endymion again. A uh, rejection. And another boar load. Dang, okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm cool with this, whatever. We leader, and then harvester, too. Dang, man. <laughs> 
We're going to get a few of that, I guess. That's, uh, that's pretty good. <laughs> Time Thief. Another one, Salvage. Zarazel. Sky Striker, Ace, uh, Kana. Then, uh, Storm Dragon's Return and Evil Eye Defeat. Unfortunately, a lot of meh ones there, but if the 10 gives you a bore load, you're kind of good then. Let's see. Creation. Then Urda. Uh, Drake, oh, yeah, Draco Berserker of the Tinny. Took me a second to read that. The <laughs> Witchcrafter, uh, Pop or Patori, that's, excuse me. And then a uh, Star Leech, Seifert. Uh, I'm trying to, like, say them so fast that I'm not saying the name. We can take a little bit of our time. Just so I don't look like too big of a moron, right? Dang, come on. There we go. There. Alright. Dino wrestlers for sure. Uh, Witchcrafter Scroll. Uh, Phantasme. There we go. I've never had too good luck getting that. Uh, we have Witchcrafter Hain. Then Witchcrafter Shimed. Shimeda? I don't know how you say the name of that one, honestly. And Evil Eye Defeat. But yeah, we got Phantasme. Even out of, I think, Dual Power, where it got its first Reaper, and I didn't have good luck getting it, so I might have a place it now. Evil Eye, then Beat Raptor, Guard Dragon LP. Okay, cool, we got the other one. Then we got uh, Cherubini, uh, Evon Angel of Burning Abyss, and then, oh, we got uh, Gizmaker Rochi. Very nice. I'll take that too. Pretty much the best Gizmek. World Legacy. Then, uh, Welling of Unchained Souls, Senate Mining, uh, Danger, uh, Ogopongo, <laughs> yeah, that's, like, one of the fun, most fun names to say, uh, let's see, Outrigger Extension, and Storm Dragon's Return. Yeah, my favorite Danger monster, just because saying that name is kind of fun. Dang, we're going through these pretty quick. All right, hopefully we can get a, I don't know, I kind of hope for another Dragoon. We'll see, because so far we're only at one. Uh, Retribution, Salvage, Striker Dragon. Okay, now that's a pretty cool one for sure. Uh, Evil Eye of Selene, and then Dirge of Lost Dragons. Yeah, that's Salvage card. I mean, we're getting a, a few of that one for sure. <laughs> One is uh, not very rare, is it? Test Panther, Sinet Mining, Sky Striker Ace, Witchcrafter, and uh, Cherub Benny again, too. I'm happy they got a reprint, though. That's like one of the coolest looking cards ever. Although, I kind of wish it was a prismatic. <laughs> you gotta love that Burning Abyss artwork, for sure. Then Overburst Dragon, Speed Lift, Witchcrafter Adele, then uh, Evil Eye Domain, and then Witchcrafter Golem Aruru. That is not easy to say. There we are. I do actually really like these tins, by the way. Like, they seem to, like, shut really well. Like, they kind of click whenever you shut them. I don't know, the quality feels better. So if you actually use these Storia cards, it might be pretty dang good for you. Another one, Crusader. Still wish that was prismatic. Uh, Dance of Beasts. Borload X-Charge Dragon. Then we have uh, Draco Masters of the Tinny. Another pretty cool looking one. Uh, Evil Eye Awakening and Gnome Material. Finally. I'm about to say, I hadn't gotten this one yet. 
Another one of the the better reprints from this for sure. No material I didn't use too much right now, but it's one of those I can always see coming in handy in the future for sure. It's definitely not a bad card. Unchained Soul of Anguish, Shinobi Necro, Guard Dragon Pisty, Win, and another Dragoon. Okay, I saw Fusion, I was hoping. So, yeah, we've gotten two of Dragoon so far. Very nice. I think we're getting close to what my friend said. For some reason lately, every time he's like, I want this card or, or something like that, I get it in an opening video, like, right after he says it. So, <laughs> he, he knows who I'm talking about right now, too. And he, I think he said I would get four Dragoons for my case. So, I'm hoping he's right. <laughs> that is uh, something I would really like to do, for sure. Blue Tang, then Blue Slug, Danger, then Witch's Strike, and Dirge Lost Dragon. Yeah, because we have a few openings on the way I hadn't even uploaded yet. Where uh, he literally talked about a card that was really rare the day before. And then I'm like, oh, well, I got a box of that. Maybe I'll get it. Boom, I got it. <laughs> I need him to tell me I'm going to get Starlight Rares like crazy. That would help. Or maybe even an Opelosa, because we have not gotten one of those yet either. Uh, Overburst Dragon, Pendulum Halt, Trickstar Corabane, Dragoon! <laughs> really? Okay, we might actually be able to do this. Okay. <laughs> so far it's working. Fusion Destiny. All right, we're only missing one, right? Dang. All right, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna need the lotto number two, by the way. <laughs> That's what I should ask him. Jelly Cannon. It's a fun one to say. I have Shinobi Necro, Blue Tang. We're a Legacy Guard Dragon. Now that looks really cool as well. Then uh, Gizmek, Orochi, and Witchcrafter Masterpiece. Yeah, I actually forgot that uh, World Lacy Guard Dragon got the prismatic treatment. But that's pretty dang awesome. Okay. Have uh, Austria Ghouls. And I don't think I've seen that one yet. Phantasme. Very nice. Uh, Draco Berserker of the Tinny. Dang, I was hoping that was another boar load. <laughs> Successor Soul and Unchained Soul of Rage. I do love how all the Unchained, like we're getting them all fairly easily. It was one of those archetypes I wanted to build, but they were always fairly expensive. So I was like, eh, I don't know, you know? There we are. Only two tins left, so we gotta get that Dragoon, and also that Opelosa. I'm, I'm more concerned with that, honestly, because, again, I do not have an Opelosa right now. So I wouldn't mind it. Overwatch Dragon, Speed Lift, Witchcrafter Hain, Witchcrafter, and uh, another one here, Benny. Not bad either. If you wanna build Witchcrafter, now's the, now's the time for sure. Probably just a few mega tens, you'll get everything you need. Unchained Soul of Disaster, uh, Madam Veer, Guard Dragon LP, another one of those, Evil Eye Domain, and then a Ruru again. The the most fun to say, for sure. <laughs> sure wish Agrapane was not banned, because I would have liked a prismatic of that too. Kinda wish they would have just thrown it in anyway. Firewall Exceed Dragon, Evil Eye Mesmerism, Time Thief Redoer, which that's another one that looks pretty dang awesome, uh, Fusion Destiny, and Abominations Prison. I want more Time Thieves as well. It's never enough, I'll be honest. And last 10. What are we ending with, you guys? Face Cam is, uh, well, hopefully it'll last a little longer. If it goes out in this last 10, I am sorry. Actually, I might reset it after this pack. All 
All right. Test Panther, Warlord X Charge Dragon. Then, Gallant Granite. It's a pretty dang awesome card, by the way. Uh, Valkyrie. I don't know. Oh, that's the one. Oh, yeah, I remember. I could never say this one's right. So, yeah, there you go. And then finish track, Earth Slicer. Yeah, that's the one I always have someone tell me I pronounce it wrong, so we're just going to back away from that. Reset face cam. All right, and back. All right, we still have two packs left. What are we getting? I think that's like, what, ten hollows left? We'll see. Firewall uh, Dragon Dark Fluid. Bye-bye damage. Another Mascarina. Okay, I'll take that. I was hoping it was Opelosa, but I'll take this too. It's my second one? Yeah. Uh, Strength in Unity. And then Memories of Hope. Not bad at all. And the last pack. Okay, what are we going to end with? Can we end, I guess, with Dragoon or Opelosa? I'll take either one, obviously. Again, I guess, you know, if he's right, our last Dragoon's supposed to be here. So we'll see. Sarazil. Marine says Seahorse. Then Destiny Hero Dominance. Evil Eye Awakening. And, ah, uh, well... We haven't gotten this one yet. Okay, that's actually cool. Destined Rivals. Yeah, that's one of the new Dark Magician Blue Eyes cards. That, that's true. I, that's the only one I've gotten from my case. So, you know what? I'll take that. <laughs> I think it's a pretty decent card. I like it mainly because of the artwork, I'll be honest. But, uh, yeah, that's not bad. Unfortunately, no Dragoon, though. So, he wasn't right. I'll have to tell him about that. But, <laughs> yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. We got quite a few Aborlode Savage. Um, you know, let me let me just do a recap real quick. All right, and uh, I did some quick sorting to kind of give you guys an idea of what we got. So I guess the, the most, like, memorable cards are, are like, some of the, the main cards you guys will care about. We have two of uh, Mascarina right here. That's, like, what I got from my case on that. Only one of Romulus, but still awesome. I mean, that's one of the main secrets I wanted, so I feel like that's notable. Then, of course, we actually got a play set, a Borload Savage Dragon. I'm happy about that. I was wondering how tough he would be to get. So that's another good one. Two of Extravagance, another one of the bigger reprints. Again, I think that gives me a playset now. And then three Dragoon from the case as well. So, honestly, I think I had a pretty good case. Unfortunately, I didn't get Opelosa, which is a card I need. But we all know it's not going to be in the end of these Mega Tens I'm going to open up. So, I'm sure we'll get one later on. But those are probably like the, the main pulls. But if you wanted to check out and see how I did on anything else, just watch the full video. I, I don't think it's too long a video at least. So, I try to go fairly quick for you guys. But I hope you enjoyed. And, uh, again... I think these Mega Sins are definitely worth picking up. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe, and I will catch you guys later. See ya.